Hey guys, welcome back to another Big Brother Chat with Carla and Willie. Uh, just wanted to apologize for not doing a video last week. Oh, crazy busy. Crazy real estate life. Mm -hmm. But we're here. Crazy. Doesn't mean we weren't watching the feeds because I was glued to them when I could be. And we were texting and yeah. sending videos and reading jokers online. And yes, and yeah. Morty's and a bunch of other yeah. rocks. So oh, there's yeah. been a lot going on. So why don't you recap where we kind of left off very quickly? Yes. So on week four, uh, Cliff actually won HOA, uh, and Bella unfortunately mm -hmm. went home. She was not the main target. No, but, but she, she was, was a casualty of mm -hmm. war. Yeah, exactly. <laughs> well, her big mouth got her out of there. So, yeah, yeah, and her quickness to go and tattletale everybody. Yeah, I think that's what did her in. So, all right, so that's where we left off before, and that brought us to week five. Yeah, which. We thought it was going to be a pivotal week, and um, we weren't sure. So go ahead and give us a recap on that. Well, yeah, so um, Holly actually won HOA, mm -hmm. which was the Poise and Ivy. Yeah, that's that dangling competition. Yeah. And that was actually on the feed. Some of them yeah. aren't shown on the feed, so we got to watch that on the feeds. And it was over two hours long. Yeah, so, yeah. yeah, so she knocked it out the park. Um, her nominees were actually Nick and Sam. Mm -hmm. um, and then Nick won the power of veto and took right. himself down. Right. Uh, then... Nick was the true target. Yeah. That's who they wanted out. But that's, of course, not always the way it is, so... Oh, yeah. Yeah. And then uh, Sam was basically, again, a casualty. Casualty of mm -hmm. circumstances and um, cat went. Yeah. However, she... all heck blew, blew up mm -hmm. the day of the last live show. Yeah. last Thursday and the feeds were blocked but there was a leak mm -hmm. so um, I found the video and, and watched it I think I sent it to you um, it was going down inside the house mm -hmm. and it flip-flopped at first Sam was the target and then yeah. it flipped to let's get out cat because Sam had gone around meticulously to everybody and planted all these little seeds and just sat back and watched. But see, Jack's, Jack kind of influenced that as well. Yeah, yeah, he kind of fueled that flame. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. He told a little secret that his buddy Mickey had told him, mm -hmm. which was... Cat and Holly knew each other. And then they threw Jackson or Mickey right. in that mix because, mm -hmm. of course, they're like, they all three know each other. And it got to Christy... And it got to Tommy, which Christy mm -hmm. and Tommy already knew, but they haven't disclosed that they are, in fact, friends, friends outside, outside the house. house. So that got them thinking, oh, wow, there are more, there is a twist to this. So paranoia set in like, mm -hmm. what they say? Everyone lost <laughs> their mind. They lost their mind and they went <laughs> to the little boat room and had a hoedown. I mm -hmm. mean, it was just... And, and like they showed it on Sunday show. Yeah. So. so, and the six shooters basically losing their mind <laughs> blew up their whole game because they the did. whole house was listening. Yeah, they were all like this. Cliff was like, shh, shh, shh. So, yeah. Um, Jack and Jack broke up. Mm -hmm. uh, Christy, a lot, a lot of people lost faith in Christy. Mm -hmm. um, Christy and Tommy still haven't told anybody that they are friends. Yes. Um, Kat and Holly denied, denied, denied continuously and she started crying and turned on the waterworks and of course they leaked her but it's like I, I do see that they're not necessarily friends but they do know each other because they Kat and Holly yeah Kat and Holly because they're in the same industry if they had not said on the show and in their secret DRs that they had a secret alliance I never would have known it because mm -hmm. they're hardly ever together on the feeds mm -hmm. but more and more they have been since that and what's happened but prior to that, I would have gone, oh, what? Mm -hmm. um, because Kat is really playing the dumb, dumb, dumb girl. Yeah. To a T. I don't think she's that dumb because she's very strategic and she's still got to be careful because I think people are picking up on her. She's, yeah. But yeah, so they've got that secret alliance and all this was going on up until the last minutes before the, the live show. Mm -hmm. So... We have the live show and they do the vote and who goes home? Sam. Sam goes home, yeah. unfortunately. So, um, I was sad to see him go. I kind of, he was starting to grow on me. 
you yeah. know, his little quirkiness and his craziness. So, um, I was sad to see that. So, it was been fun to see all that play out on the feeds. I wish after the show they would open up the feeds and take the, the block off, but they never do. Yeah. So, but from that, a lot of things happened. Jack and Jack broke out. Mm -hmm. Uh, a lot of the little side alliances have started to... They started fizzling out. Mm -hmm. um, well, now you got Cliff's Angels. Cliff's Angels that, that started to come mm -hmm. to come together. So, yeah. So, there's a lot going on. So, that brings us up to the HOH competition, mm -hmm. um, which um, was not shown on the feeds. No. Um, it was blocked. So, they alluded to it. They showed them at the closing of the, the last eviction show of going around at the Camp Expo, which is a memory game. Mm -hmm. And you want to share with who won? Yeah, so... Jessica. Jessica! Yeah. So we were hoping for a change of power, <laughs> and it came! Yes, finally. Okay, okay, okay. Somebody that had... The cojones. Yeah, she, she had been an outsider. No one was talking game with her. They were just kind of leaving her alone. Ignoring her. Mm -hmm, and talking basically. in front of her. Oh, like, yeah. How many conversations happened at the kitchen table and she's right there cooking? Mm -hmm. They complained about her, using all the food. I mean, yeah. Yeah, they were just turn. doing rude. But uh, so, you want to say who went up on the block? Yes. The two Jacks. <laughs> <laughs> thank you, thank you, thank you. So and I was worried because... When she won, I was up throughout the night, that, that Thursday night into Friday, and they were up really late. Our time, 8 or 9 in the morning. It was mm -hmm. about 8, so I think they were still. And she was really careful, I was impressed with her, that she was not revealing what her true target was to even people that were kind of in her little yeah. quasi alliance. So I was proud of that because she had said in her DRs, which no one else in the house is gets to see that that's who our targets were. Mm -hmm. But to people in the HOH room, she wasn't giving all that away. And she was kind of going back and forth, should I do this, should I do that, should I do this, should I do that, do that. But in her mind, she already had her plan and she stuck to it. She didn't let them change. And this brings me to another thing. They are all up in there, Holly, and all of them are up there and it drives me crazy. Mm -hmm. They get into their- It's fake. They get in there and three of them are sleep off. There's there's Kat, Nicole, and Jessica are sleeping in the HOH bed every night. Mm -hmm. well, I mean, like this morning, it was eight seven thirty eight o'clock our time, and they were just going to bed. So, I well, don't know. at this point, we got some spoil alerts coming. We so do, if you we do, we do, we do. Want to know? So, go ahead we and know stop that Jack and Jack mm -hmm. are on. And if you know, you know the true schedule of what's going on in the house, the POV uh, competition has actually already happened. Yes. It's happened a couple days ago, I think Saturday? Sunday. Sunday. I think Sunday they do the competition and then yeah. they don't really reveal it to us until yeah. Wednesday. Mm -hmm. And then Thursday is the live eviction. Right. So, guess who won mm -hmm. the power of veto? Jessica. Jessica! <laughs> now, we don't know the competition. Mm -hmm. uh, heard lots of little bits and pieces, but whatever it was, girl got game and pulled it out. There's a punishment involved in that one, right? That, we didn't talk about the punishment yes. of the hanging competition oh, yeah. either. The poison ivy. Mm -hmm. well, I think they showed that on the show. Yeah, they did show that on the show. And then they, they were had patches and then they turned pink. Well, that went away and they couldn't take a shower. For like yeah, four, four days. days. Woo! Yeah. Um, but yeah, so there's another punishment, which I don't know how he earned it, but who earned it? Uh, it was Tommy, again. <laughs> <laughs> he looks like a space cadet, and I've seen it on the feeds, and he has this big red cone head thing. It looks to be like this big. Yeah. And he has to run around saying he's whatever. I'm traveling at the speed Beautiful. of either light or sound whatever. or smell. And he's got these two things that stink to high heaven, and he has to go and spray his flunk all over the house. Well, he has three different ones. So it's the lights. Mm -hmm. He has, that's the speed of light. Mm -hmm. and then he has the speed of sound, which are air horns. Mm -hmm. And then the speed of smell, which are basically like, in a sense, like a stink bomb with a blower. Little can things. Yeah. 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 Everybody was like yeah. grossed out by it. That one they showed on the feed. The noise one, they haven't shown that one. Oh yeah, they did. Did they? I must have yeah. missed that. <laughs> Can't watch it all the time. But yeah. 
So that's cute. He's got this big, huge. He's the perfect player because he's about this big. Mm -hmm. <laughs> he reminds me of like Toad from Mario. Yeah. Exactly. That's exactly what it was. Could you imagine if one of the Jacks was in that comp? Oh, God. That, that, that get up. They'd be getting They haven't had a Minotaur mm -hmm. this year. So. Mm -hmm. so, Jessica pulled it out. She holds all the power. Mm -hmm. This so, is her house this this week. Which I'm excited because it's a flip. The whole thing has flipped mm -hmm. and come full circle because the one side had dominated the first couple mm -hmm. of weeks. And now... But her, her speech, though, after she did win the HOH, you know, mm -hmm. she wanted to make them feel how she felt in the mm -hmm. house, which I thought was great because it's like giving right. them a taste of their own medicine. Right. But she had le legitimate reasons why to put them mm -hmm. up because she had been put up and then she was backstabbed. She was banished. She was put banished, on a block. Right. So mm -hmm. in all, in all, from a house guest point of view, that was the least amount of blood, you know, that was saying, mm -hmm. I don't get blood on my hand. That really was, um, from their point of view, a good, mm -hmm. you know, you could at least explain why you put them up. Exactly. So, so I thought that was pretty good and that will help her game in the end. I'm hoping she makes it towards the end. I, I think she will. She keeps up a good game. I mean, she's been pulling wins out of nowhere mm -hmm. all of a sudden. Well, we know she's not going to do good in certain physical. Yeah. Unless she's stronger and she's just downplaying it. Anything with hanging, I just don't think the... F Even the... I mean, a lot of competitions that like the hanging on the wall, they haven't done that one yet. And then, of course, the running back and forth, filling the cups or whatever. She might do okay with that. But some of the other competitions, they're not geared for large people. Mm -mm. That's why the, you know, Nicole or Tommy would be good mm -hmm. winners for that. So, there's been a lot of chitter-chatter on the feeds mm -hmm. um, on who's going to be going home. I've heard both of them. <laughs> and there is for both. So, who do you think? I think if they do it right, then they listen. Send Mickey on out that house. That's what yeah. I like to see. It's, it's not because I, I don't like him. He's just, he plays it too too hard mm -hmm. to begin with. Mm -hmm. He takes everything so personal. He's degrading to people. Yeah. And he just thinks, the watermelon thing, I don't know, if you guys are watching the feeds, the man thinks he owns every watermelon that comes in the house. Mm. And I know that sounds petty. But even when he was a have-not, he was telling everybody to save his food. I'm like, dude, you get you, you get groceries every week. Exactly. <laughs> so yeah. So I I didn't want to mark who's have-nots right now. Yeah. Uh, I'm I'm not sure who the have-nots are, but um, that's okay. No Is everything really else going on? I'm not even sure they had no have-nots this week. I can't remember. I think yeah, you know what? I think I did see Holly and mm -hmm. Jackson or. AKA Nikki yeah, he might be. in there. I think okay. they've been in there because they were doing laundry from that room. Okay. There yeah. You go. So I was just so excited, Jessica. I didn't care less about that. <laughs> because they're not giving them the, the crazy food. It's just yeah. the slop. So um, so Jessica's in full power this week. Mm -hmm. And there's flip flopping. I've heard both scenarios Jack or Jack, Nikki or whatever. And I'm kind of thinking they're going to keep Mickey. Yeah. And they're going to send home Jack. But Jack is in there doing dishes, cleaning up, getting in conversations with people you had never seen him talking to. He's working it. Mm hmm Mickey is hiding. Yeah. First day after all that blow up, I don't think I saw him once or twice on the he's a, he He's a sore loser in my opinion. Yeah. He, he's, yeah. he's a true bully. Yeah. Like he just, I hate to use the word bully, but it's not quite a bully, but he's pretty darn close. So, um, with this, since mm -hmm. um, Jessica won, Christy's power is gone. Yep. It's she dead. didn't use the power of veto, mm -hmm. so that power is dead no longer. Dead. dead, dead. <laughs> oh, the other thing we learned about this this last episode is the America's vote. Mm -hmm. Have you guys been voting, and who have you voted for? Tell us below. I voted for Tommy and Holly, and I believe Jack, because my thoughts are I want Tommy to win it. Mm -hmm. Holly's just kind of filler, and then Jack, if he can get that third Split place, yeah. Okay. It's funny because we didn't talk about this mm -hmm. prior to who we were going to vote for, and I voted for Tommy, Holly, and Christy. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Pretty close. We got two of the same three, so we'll see. Are they going to reveal, reveal that this week, I think? Yeah, it's it should be trip, Thursday maybe. because it should be eight days from, well, no, that would be a week, so it will be on... 
Will it happen after this? Friday. Election? So it okay. should be Friday. if Because they said eight days. Okay. For we voting. have to vote. Yeah. So unless... So keep voting, guys. Vote. I don't think it's ended yet. Thursday to Thursday. Okay. Maybe. So keep voting. Mm -hmm. um, so I'm going to post some questions. I've got a couple here. Who do you think is going to go home, first and foremost? From this week? Jack or Jack. Because mm -hmm. uh, we're, we're looming on a double eviction. I'm hoping for Mickey. Mickey. That's that's my thought is Mickey because they've been kind of flipping back mm -hmm. and forth on the last feeds I seen was this morning and they were talking about Mickey. Yeah, I, I I'd be happy with either one, but I think Jack would not have been the character that he was had he not had Jack, mm -hmm. the other Jack to play off of, because mm -hmm. he's got a soft side. Mickey doesn't. Mm -mm. He's just all. I mean, there's a reason they gave him the nicknames of jackals. <laughs> so, <laughs> <laughs> I mean, Jack. Let's not say Jack has said some nasty stuff, mm -hmm. but I don't. I think that Jackson knew exactly what to say to get Jack to do what he did. Yeah. So, I think it would have been a totally different Jack had Jackson not been. Too much testosterone in that yeah, group. Yeah. So, uh, either one for me, and you'd rather. Mickey go home. Yeah, I'd rather Mickey go home. Mm -hmm. So we're looming on what we think is, what we I think we know for sure, that mm -hmm. it's a double eviction. It's about time. This uh, evictee is the first um, jury member, mm -hmm. so they got to start really thinking about jury management. You're yep. going to see the um, goodbye messages really take a spin. People mm -hmm. want to really start playing to those. And you're going to see a lot of people trying to get more social and get to know these people. Yeah. Build those relationships. So it's a lot like real estate. Mm -hmm, exactly. <laughs> <laughs> Build that rapport. Just, that trust and rapport. <laughs> there you go. That was funny. Oh, we did not rehearse that, by the way. <laughs> um, I always equate, equate life to Big Brother. It's, it's just terrible. Okay, that'd be a whole other video ahead. on its own. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> okay. So what's going to happen to the six shooters? Uh, well, we already know they've crumbled amongst themselves. Mm -hmm. Will and... they be able to rebound? No, because one of them's going home. Well, so yeah. <laughs> it'll be five, five left. Five. But uh, yeah, I think it's because Chris. A lot of people in that group do not trust Christy to begin with, yeah. and Tommy's going to definitely run with Christy because I think they do have a final two. You know, if thinking on it, they are friends outside, or at least she dated his sister. Yeah. I think so. They they know yeah. each other. Mm -hmm. Um, however, I really feel it's, the house is going to start flipping a little bit. Um, cause you do got the wild cards that Cliff is saying he's working with Kat. He's working with Nicole, um, Jessica, mm -hmm. uh, who was the other one that was in that mix of things? Yes. Cliff's Angels. Yeah. Cliff's Angels. I think it was Jessica, Nicole and Kat. Mm -hmm. I think. And then you got Cliff in there. Um, Tommy is kind of like teetering a little bit with that group, but not too much. Mm -hmm. He's been trying to keep quiet on right. a lot of things. Right. But he does get caught talking a lot. Tommy does. Yeah, yeah he, does. he does. He think, talks a lot. Yeah. And that's what's the house is not that big. Up. It looks huge, but from what I've heard, it's not as big as you think it is. Yeah. And it seems to me like they can hear through the walls more this year. Yeah, I noticed that the boat room. A lot of people walk by and then they stop because they hear stuff. I don't remember it being quite that. Yeah, I feel like they've. I don't. They read. They. I think they made it a little bit bigger to accommodate that sofa. Yeah, I don't I know. Don't they've know. done I'm something. Not sure, something's changed. But people hear everything. They, it seems like. Yeah, I don't know if they did that on purpose. So my other question I was going to pose. I'm put it here. Uh, will Cat and Holly stay strong with their secret alliance? What y'all think? I think it's been ousted, personally. You think? With that, well, them just knowing each other. I think since that got ousted. I think that's planted the seed. Sam yeah. was successful in, mm -hmm. in, in getting that out there. But they don't believe, do they really believe it or do they not believe it? I'm not sure. I don't know. I'm not sure. Um, I think uh, aside from Kat and Holly, I think they're going to make it mm -hmm. a little bit longer mm -hmm. in the house if they keep playing the game right. Mm -hmm. um, Christy and Tommy will make it a little bit further, but I think Tommy's better start looking up for his game and drop Christy pretty soon. Christy's going to shoot herself in her foot mm -hmm. if she doesn't watch it because she likes to talk. Yeah. But she also does have a good social game where people do talk to mm -hmm. her often. Mm -hmm. And it could just be because she's a great source of knowledge of what's going on in the house. Feeds are heating up, but like mm -hmm. I said, because I think they know now, these are all the jury members, 
and they're trying to build those relationships. So people are spilling secrets and all kinds of crazy stuff. So um, we've seen a new side of Nick, which we haven't mm -hmm. talked about. <laughs> <laughs> Nick is cozying up with with um, with Tommy. With yeah. Tommy, mm -hmm. they're getting to be snuggle buddies and yeah. uh, mm -hmm. questioning his son. Um, There's a little question in there, but hey. His snuggle buddy partners, but yeah, yeah. so yeah, we'll mm -hmm. just leave it at that. Yeah. But yeah, it's been comical. Um, okay, so the last question, it's coming up on a double. Mm -hmm. Who do you want to win? HOH. All right, so the next HOH should, I, I'm hoping for Nicole or Cliff to pull it out. Simply because if they get it, then they can take another piece out of the six shooters. That's about, about the only mm -hmm. option because yeah, pretty With much. One of the Jacks gone. Mm -hmm. That's going to leave Annalise, Christy, Cliff, Holly, Jessica, Catherine, Tommy, Nicole, and Nick. Mm -hmm. And one of the Jacks. And one of the Jacks. Still seems like a lot of people mm -hmm. in the house. I mean, we still got a way to go. Yeah. You know, we still go through just till September. So Jessica can't play. Mm -hmm. So you said Cat or. Uh, I was saying Nicole, Nicole. or. Uh -huh. Or cat. A cat. One of those two. Or Cliff, you did mention. Oh yeah, Cliff. Cliff. Yeah. Okay. But if one of those three pulls it out, then I they think can... they should be safe. I wouldn't mind. I mean, I know a lot of people are calling these people floaters, but I think the way that this season has played out, they're not quite floaters. They haven't been given the opportunity to strike mm -hmm. up until Jessica's. Mm -hmm. I mean, Cliff had it, but for some reason, Cliff kind of. I'm not. He sure. was playing both sides. Yeah. He was playing both sides a little bit. So Jessica's really, in my mind, mm -hmm. the first person to make a true play. Mm -hmm. um, but yeah, if one of them gets it and they do mm -hmm. <laughs> what they're supposed to do and play Big Brother. And make, make moves to win yeah, the game. So now it's break time you need to start uh, making moves. Because that's, that's been mm -hmm. their plan is to break up all the couples. Right. Well, with one of the Jacks going, one of those of the four will be gone. Yeah. And Elise and, or, and Holly and then Jack and Jackson. Mm -hmm. So one of those, so you'll still have one of those, you know, showmances still left, yeah. attacked. And then, um, then attack them again, yeah. get another one out, yeah. and then back to where, if it comes down to it, right. back to where one of the other people, right. and then hope and pray that either Jessica or whoever from right. that four person alliance right. gets it again, then I think they should be good. I would, um, I would, I would like, I would like to see what Tommy would really do. Mm -hmm. That would put him in a bad position because I don't think he's been showing us his full force of going mm -hmm. after the comps. Christy, I'm tired of seeing her at the HOH. Um, She's gonna cry. Catherine again. would be interesting, <laughs> and I'm wondering what Nick would do. Um, I think Nick is playing a little bit too much towards the six shooters. He's playing it kind of safe. Mm -hmm. So I wouldn't mind Nicole, like you said. Yeah. So, but it's a double, so that means it's going to be quick. Yeah. So, so we're going to have two HOHs this week. So. Well, I don't think it's this week, but they, it should be coming up soon. Mm -hmm. I really do feel like a double is mm -hmm. in the next week or two. Yeah. Yeah. I think so too. So, I'm gonna, I'm gonna agree with you on um, Cliff, Nicole, or Catherine. Mm -hmm. If not one of those, I wouldn't mind seeing Nick or Tommy, mm -hmm. uh, HOH, because that will force them to step out of that comfort zone. And because they've kind yeah. of been floaters. I know they've been telling the, you know, Cliff and them are floaters, but on the team, you're floating too. You're not making game moves. It so. should be, you know, like throwing those rogue votes out there. Mm -hmm. Just making people crazy trying to figure out who it would be. I mean, if I was on Big Brother, oh, I would be... be wreaking havoc in that house. Uh, I would be moving things, stealing things, making people paranoid. Mm -hmm. So I would, I don't know. I, we haven't seen a lot of that this year. We've seen the dancing, which is cute. Um, mm -hmm. They've been playing little silly games here and there, but... They're just not... You don't have any people jumping out and scaring folks. You don't have... I've seen them hiding. Yeah. Annalise hid in the trash can. <laughs> <laughs> but, you know, like, they're not... I feel I like they're kind of... Like someone else was saying uh, on some of the feed rooms that I go through, they were saying, you know, like, kind of they got more so pretty people rather than people that are actually into the game itself. I think some of them are gamers, but I think some of them are really playing to the cameras. Yeah. I mean, they're like looking at the cameras, making sure they're talking about who's the camera on all the time. They're really obsessed with the cameras. Yes. More so than any cast that I can remember in recent years. 
also, oh, that's kind of disappointing. And so many of them have reasons for being on there. Holly and her family business. Mm -hmm. Christy that. owns a boutique. Christy owns a boutique. You know, Jackson wants to be this, you know, movie star. Tommy wants to be obviously a dancer. He's been on Broadway and stuff. So, He's on Broadway. You know, and Jessica is a model, so she's, mm -hmm. she's known out there. So, um, we got gamers, but not strategic gamers. Yeah. So, I don't know. But I'm still having fun watching the feeds. <laughs> I was really excited this past week because I had a lot of late, late, late nights watching the feeds. <laughs> seeing what was happening. So, all right. Well, we'll, we'll have to check in. Yeah. So, and see. Let us know who you mm -hmm. think is going to go, Jack or Jackson. Mm hmm. And then who you want to see the next HOH. Because Jessica's out. She's our power player. And um, let us know. Yeah. And don't forget to vote. Go online yes. and vote right now. Go vote. Because <laughs> that would be one nominee, auto mm -hmm. automatic nominee. Yep. Uh, one safe. Mm -hmm. And I guess I'm not sure if the other one's just a gimme. Yeah. So that could be a game changer. Mm -hmm. So I'm curious to see who wins the top three votes on that. And so go vote for that. And I guess we'll see you next time, guys. All right. Well, like, share, and comment below. And we'll see you guys soon again. Bye.